All right, here's the next fan for y'all out there. Uh, this is a little Brookstone mini tower fan. I bought this, I think, July of 2013. I honestly don't remember. I know it was somewhere in 2013. And I'm going to be, I'm just going to be honest and real here. It's not one of the best fans I've ever purchased. Um, for a Brookstone, I bought this because I thought it was an absolute genius idea. Because literally this thing is very thin. Like, so thin. And I thought that it would be the best idea to go ahead and buy one. Well, of course, they had the display models, and they were pretty loud. I figured, you know what, I think it's just because they're old, they're disgusting, uh, so I went ahead and bought one. Sadly, all the ones that I've heard are exactly the same. Um, I have a blue one as well, which and sadly the adapter that broke on it makes the exact same noises. Uh, my friend has a red one, and his makes the exact same noises, so I guess they all make this noise. Uh, if it wasn't for the noise, it would be a decent fan, um, but for the noise it is pretty loud, so I'll turn it on low first. It does oscillate. Which can be turned off. But for this video, we'll just keep it on. And right now, it's not so bad, but just barely blowing a breeze, so I don't see how that could be useful. Medium speed. Starts to get very annoying and very irritating pretty quickly. Moving an okay amount of air. And then high setting, which is powerful, but most annoying. And like I said, I've tried to, you know, get over the noise, but it's very annoying. It does say on the box, ultra quiet, and I would not consider this ultra quiet. It doesn't sound like a regular fan either. I mean, if it sounded like a regular fan, we would have been fine. But with this, I I just can't stand it. I have a very high tolerance for fan noise, and I can tell you what, this does distract me a lot. Um, and I mean, you know, if you're on the low setting, it's just not even that powerful. So I'm kind of forced to use it on the high setting. I've opened, I've tried to open it up, and um, no luck in that. So, I guess I'm just going to end this video now, because I am getting pretty annoyed by the sound of this fan. If it wasn't for the noise, I would actually recommend it, but otherwise, if you can get past the noise, probably the fan for you. But if you're looking for a fan that doesn't make this noise, or doesn't sound like this, you should probably look elsewhere. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, see you guys later.